Welcome back everyone. It is Friday, December 23rd. It is Christmas Eve. We're coming to you live from Saskatchewan, Canada, better known as North Carolina. It's currently 28 degrees. Getting these <laughs> you guys look nice and comfy in here, huh? Oh yeah, wow, what a difference. It's It's gotta be, I don't know, it's definitely a lot warmer in there when you stick your hand there. So that solves the question I was going to ask is if I should leave them in here all day. And uh, that's what we're going to do. We're going to leave them. Watch out, boys. Let me in. I got to give you some water. Yeah, it's a lot warmer in here. What are you guys doing? Just doing nothing? Uh, right now, it's it's going to dip down to about 9, uh, nine degrees tonight. Tomorrow is going to be 8, and then it's going to be 16 degrees the following day. My parents just lost power, so what I'm going to do is help my mom clean up one of the, we have a smaller bird's cage, we're going to pack the bird up, the cat and the dog, rather than be a little bit uncomfortable staying at my house in a new setting, than staying here with their gas fireplace on trying to like huddle up, I don't understand my, that's not even like an option, my mom said it and I don't think it's even wise, uh, Monique and I had a full home generator set up, one of the Genracks put in on our house, so we're, they're not putting us out of our way, it just kind of, it makes more sense, it's, it's not even like smart or healthy to even think about sitting in your home with no power. So we're going to pack their animals up, bring them back to our house, and kind of just go from there. Uh, the goats, I, I, I truly think I'm going to leave them inside the pen. It's not windy. The wind is coming from, it's hitting from the back of the wall here, which is uh, the north. It's hitting from the back coming, obviously, going that way. Um, and it's it's relatively comfortable in here. Even, it's, it's freezing out, and their water, this is like the most impressive, excuse me, buddy. Sorry if I'm shaking around a lot today. I'm just trying to... I want to make sure that... Yeah, the water is... You guys can't see that. It's not frozen, which is really great. Here, let me get a better angle here. Yeah. It's just got their hay inside of it. Oh, oh, you're going to knock them over. <laughs> let, me, uh, let me put you guys down. Let them out. Get them fed, which is the most important thing. And uh, go from there. yesterday so I left the wheelbarrow wheel barrel down so I could collect water and I got a whole bucket full it's a little icy but not too too bad it didn't really ice up bad so I, I just picked out a bunch of the ice out of it set it down give them their grain and close them up no protesting So here's some of their, their mineral here. This is the goat mineral. Buddy, those are my gloves, you can't eat them. I just want to make sure that they have enough coming out. I got it to kick down a little bit over here. Guys, stop being so nosy. This is baking soda for them. Uh, I'd have to ask my mom. I'll put, the, I'll put it in the description as to why they need the baking soda. I don't truly know. I'm not gonna sit here and make it up, but uh, Excuse me. You see, he's hitting it nice. Good job, Troy. Excuse me, bud. Here's the bedding. I fluff it up just so that they could hop back on it. We added a whole nother uh, bale of straw to it yesterday just to make it. Well, it was either yesterday or the day before. I don't know. Maybe the day before. But some new fresh cut stuff. I'm gonna go get them uh, what they really want. They don't really want to give me love. They wanna they just want their grain. Whew. Watch your face boys. I think this is frozen. Hold on. Watch your face, watch your face, watch your face.
Get out, get out, get out. Get out, you fatty. Come on. You two, you can't even reach. Come on, let's go. Let's go get some food. Come on. Look at this. They're actually quite smart. Look at them. They know in the morning time they get fed there, and at night they get in the in their pen. But we're gonna change that up a little bit. Watch out, boys. Watch out. Coming in hot. All right, so they got everything that they're gonna need. I think we're pretty set. We're pretty sure that we're gonna keep them set up in, in here today. Like I said, I kind of feel bad leaving them inside, but there's not much. What are they gonna do out here besides deal with the wind? So they're eating, they seem pretty happy. Uh, I fluffed up their bed a little bit, gave them new hay, filled up the water. Tonight, I just gotta fill up another I'm gonna probably bring down a like a, a five gallon jug of water, one of them, you know, jugs you get delivered like Poland Spring or whatever to your house, or you get at the store refilled. Have that brought down. This is the water situation. Filled up this bucket. Gonna go bring it in there, dump out what they have now, fill back up with this. Try this again. No, just a little bit of ice on top, as in that piece of hay right here has some, but that's really about it. This all, this has all been, it's, not, it's nothing really frozen. It's not frozen at all, just besides that little piece there, which is a good thing. What I'm trying to do is just kick a, try to make a hole in here, almost like a windbreak. Not sure if that's going to do anything for them. In my mind, they'll use it as a uh, the bed in here, but I don't really know. I'm not a goat. I know you're starving. No one loves you. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. That po that's polite, which means get the heck out of my way. Come on, move. Watch out. You too. Come on. Okay, I'm going this way. Come on. Wait out. Guys, I gotta move the bedding. Come on, come on. Come on. Go, 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 go. Thank you. Sheesh. Tough crowd. I'm gonna go grab them another sleeve of hay. Just because it is, it is really disgustingly cold out. That's why we keep it in here. It stays nice and dry. That's basically about it, everyone. I'm not gonna sit here and pretend like there's a whole to-do of stuff going on today. Just really simple. 
whole objective of today was to stay warm and I think we did pretty well. My parents, they just got their heat back on. My sister, my nieces, my brother-in-law, they were over, they just got their power back on and their heat. We did lose our power. The generator kicked on, it was on for about four hours. Uh, Duke Energy came, sent a text saying that uh, it was due to a tree fell and 326 homes, I believe it said, 325, 26 homes were affected by it. Our community was one of them, which is fine. Everyone did well. Uh, I believe Monique sent out a text, if anyone needs to come by and needs power, heat, or water, anything, come to our house. We, the generator kicked on right away, was running constantly. Uh, we didn't skip a beat. The only thing we did lose and still don't have right now is Wi-Fi, but, uh, you can, you can live without Wi-Fi. My little guy and my nieces, Wi-Fi is right there with heat, food, and water, but uh, they'll make do. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short video today. Hope everyone has a Merry Christmas. I'll see you guys in a few days. We're not, it would, we're, they're not.